two brand new pedals from a company brand new to making pedals. A-Labs has sent me a multi-function modulation and a multi-function delay pedal. We're going to check them out together today, right here on Geargasms. Hi everybody, welcome to Geargasms. I'm your host, Alan Barnes. Today we've got two brand new multi-function pedals, the Nova Drift Modulation and the Time Slip Delay. We're going to talk about these pedals in just a second, but first, if you're new to the channel, I'd like to ask you to like and subscribe. This channel is kind of like Microsoft Vista. You don't really remember it so much as that you remember that you hated it. Celebrate mediocrity. Now, there's nothing mediocre about these pedals from A-Labs, and I'm not just saying that because they sent them to me for free. That makes it a sponsored video. But what we're going to do is we're going to hook them up b -b 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 by themselves, and we're going to hear go through all of these functions. There are a lot on both pedals. I normally don't love unboxings, but this is a brand new, these are brand new pedals from a company brand new to making pedals. Comes with a manual. Look how they protect their controls there with that special piece of foam. I don't, I don't really know how to describe it. It's kind of a matte finish. Time keeps on slipping. And can you see again what what? First up, we've got the Nova Drift modulation pedal. It has nine forms of modulation. Can you believe it? From vibe to chorus, multi-chorus, phaser, filter, rotary, flanger, tremolo, and a ring modulator. With each effect, you've got three controls. You can control the rate, the depth, and the mix. You'll notice that little switch there that has tap and infinite. You can also throw it into tap mode and do tap tempo. I think I saw something in the manual about you could long press and access some hidden parameters with these knobs as well. Through stereo input and output. Runs off nine volt power supply. Time slip delay pedal also has nine modes. You can get tape echo, digital delay, analog delay, reverse echo, you can get warped echo, you can get granule echo, octave echo, a sweeper delay function as well as a swell delay. Across the top, you have your normal delay knobs there. You've got time, repeat, and mix. You had a tone control on the modulation. On this particular pedal in the same spot, we have a modulation knob. That'll be fun to check out. So we're going to do both of these pedals in the same video. I apologize in advance for not getting to every single thing about these things that you're going to want to hear, but I couldn't bear to separate them. Alrighty, I'm going to ask your forgiveness right up front because I got two pedals to do. So we're going to hit things fast, but you'll get the gist of everything. These pedals have a lot of functionality. One thing I wanted to show you real quick. I know it's kind of shadowy. I'm sorry, but that's the inside graphics that I couldn't really show you for the box. We'll start with the mods. This is called the Nova Drift pedal. The first mode on this is vibe. Oh, by the way, rig of the day. Epiphone Les Paul Special into the EVH5150 EL334. Flex. EL, EL34. 50 watt. SM57 on the microphone. Now we're gonna start off clean with a lot of these mods, but we will add dirt where appropriate, but only from the amp. That's the only thing we got. Just these pedals are in the loop of, of the 5150. Oh, you suck. And when you hear a little bit of noise, it ain't the pedals, it's the EVH. Let's just hit this tone real quick. Oh, you see how much top end came in there? We'll keep it in the middle, but that's an important control for especially for these mods to season the taste. All right, that's the vibe. Next is chorus. We're gonna set everything mids. Depth way up. Keep the speed down. That mix. 
Oh, <laughs> that's nice. And if you like chipmunks. What is next? Multi-chorus. And I want to apologize real quick about the, the, the camera too. You can't really see these labels all that well. They're very subtle. It was difficult to get that lit. Now, what do these chipmunks sound like? Are you ready? Nexty. Put phaser. Lightning crashes, no mother died. That's my new phaser song. I like it, subtle, unlike myself. It's a filter. You know, I didn't expect to like this. And by the way, I'm hearing this, the, all these for the first time, same as you all. I did, two reasons. I wanted my responses to be genuine. And I just don't have time to go through these things with that full-time job and all. Like my old envelope filter. What's, let's just do the rate all the way up. Rate and depth. We'll extreme it. Reset everything, and we're coming down to rotary. See a good rotary with a rate turned back. It's almost a chorus. Chip monkey. Let's go back to subtle. That's nice. That's so nice. Next day, flange me, baby. Oh, nice. Do we chipmunks? <laughs> Don't you love them chipmunks? Dang on, we still got more, more, more. I've lost count. Tremolo. I like that. Gives you a little wiggle. I was never much of a tremolo guy. I don't really know what to play, obviously. In tremolo, lastly, but not leastly, for this one, ring modulator. Let's get modulated. <laughs> I can hear that soon. Never understood ring modulators. People like them? So that's everything for the Nova Drift modulation pedal. We're going to switch over to the time slip delay pedal and see what that one can do. Time keeps on slipping. What's first? Tape. How much time we got? 
You tell me, math kids. 800 mil, <laughs> 800 mil a second. I think, you know what we need for tape? We really want to get the gist of tape, right? Right. We'll keep the repeats down. We'll keep the time in there. We'll turn the mix up a little bit. You want to hear tape, do you? I think this might be more suited. You want subtle? I like it. Nexty, we've got digital. That's my favorite. Let's get that time up a little bit so we can hear them repeat. One thing we've got to do on the last one, what does this mod thing do? Let's find out. Let's go back to clean. Okay, does what I thought. It adds modulation. How about that? That is something else. So yeah, you can get your chorus and your digital. Let me turn that mod all the way up. <laughs> I like that. That's killer. Analog. Can you dig it? Can you dig it? Yeah, I wanted to hear it fart as it went down. That's analog, baby. Let's do that mod. Oh, that's pretty sweet. Nice. What is next? Reverse. Dare we hit this mod control? Gosh, some letters are tiny. Warp. So this is, what does warp do? Modulate it. No, I want more time. You know what I like to do with delay pedals? Space stuff. This one is called granule. Granule? Oh, yeah. More aliens, but what in the world does the mod do? Oh, that's neat. Rock octave, we know what this is. We'll hit this note. That time up. Maybe you'd like to hear it without the mod. That was cool. Sweeper. What, what are we going to sweep now? Oh, I hear what it's doing in there, even without the mod. <laughs> what does the mod do to this? Swell. Now we know what this one does. I think it's, I think it's pretty swell.
So you turn that mix all the way up. time lower. It gets swell faster. Oh, we didn't modulate the swell, did we? I tried a free bird on that. That didn't work out. <laughs> so now what we're going to do is put these two pedals together, join forces. We're going to go into a higher gain setting and see if we can find if there's any cool stuff we can do with these pedals in tandem. Oh, you hear that hiss? We're on the red channel, the EVH 5150, because I just wanted to scrunk these two pedals for you in tandem. The Charvel DK24. We need some humbuckers for this experiment. First thing you want to do, like, say you're like me or like everybody else, you're kind of an Eddie guy, Eddie head. We'll go over here to Phaser. We'll dial up the ingredients. We're going to go with analog delay. That actually quieted up the amp a little bit when I kicked those in. Did you hear that? How about that? All right, right away, you're like, oh, whoa, dude, that ain't Eddie. First of all, that's got to come down. That mix needs to come down. Let's just do one at a time. Come on! All right, so I think I got that. <laughs> now let's check this other thing. Still not there though. I'm not. I'm not convinced. We'll take that back out. I call that a success, folks. Very nice. Let's have some more fun, peeps. Let's do chorus next. We just want a little bit of it in the mix. Because Tony Iommi definitely used a lot of chorus on his stuff. When you got high gain, flanger's fun. Let's get weird. Well, since I just like flanger, let's, let's not get too weird with it. Let's just do flanger with digital delay.
What did we learn today? We learned that the A-Labs Nova Drift has managed to pack nine powerful modulation algorithms into a single pedal. We also learned that the A-Labs Time Slip Delay pedal managed also to pack nine really juicy usable delay algorithms into a single pedal, but they added a mod dial. What we didn't learn is Although I understand these pedals are going to be available on Amazon, I do not yet know when they're going to be available and what the price is going to be. Christmas is coming, so I'm sure by the time this video airs, you'll have a price. And of course, product link will be in the description. I'd like to thank A-Labs for sending me those two pedals to share with you guys, and I'd also like to thank you all for the time that you spend with the channel. Please don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. Have you got some embarrassing, slow-witted, moochy, bottom-of-the-barrel friends? Come on, they're going to fit right in here perfectly. Christmas is coming, like I said before. Wouldn't you like to buy that person in your life that you cannot stand some Geargasms merchandise? Whatever you do in the next seven days, don't tell anyone who is stupid enough to believe in the Facebook bypass. No, you're not getting a brand new news feed. No, you're not going to be able to stop ads. And P.S. You can't post something on Facebook that prevents them from selling your pictures and your data. They're going to sell your pictures and your data. Ain't nothing you can do about it. That sounds crazy! But play more guitar. Watch less of this. Keep coming back here week after week for more Geargasms.